So after um, a year uh, that I've been using Copilot, I decided to take a break from it. From uh, it, not that I don't like Copilot; it's actually quite great, and you can feel that it's getting better. But because I'm a NeoVim user, uh, the integration with NeoVim was a little bit poor. It wasn't so much about the missing chat as much as it mostly got in your way. But don't get me wrong, I like Copilot. I like using it. So until they actually improve the, the NeoVim plugin, which at this point is at 1.4, if I'm not mistaken, I decided to give Cody a go. So Cody is an AI assistant, exactly like Copilot from Sourcegraph, and um, it has a way better integration with NeoVim at this point of time than Copilot. One of the things I like the most is that you can easily configure it to not automatically um, fill in a suggestion which gets in your way. As we can see here, the moment I start writing something, I get a suggestion. And I'm getting the suggestions through the LSP menu. So, for example, if I do state dot write I see both the code is suggesting as well as well as well as the LSP suggestions, which is quite nice because sometimes Copilot, right? Although it auto completes the right thing, it doesn't bring all the dependencies that it needs automatically, like some LSPs do, and that can be really annoying because what I used to end up doing is like complete, go back to the missing dependencies. Delete the character, write the character, select it from the LSP, drop down, and then go on. And th that was annoying. So in this case, I can easily select which one I want. And maybe there is a way to configure Copilot to do something similar, although I'm not aware of one. But what Cody has, which at this point is missing from the NeoVim Copilot integration, is Cody Chat, which you can ask some questions. Let's try, can you explain what in hack mutex is in Rust? and uh, give us the explanation. Which is quite nice, but uh, Code Chat doesn't interact with your code, so it's mostly there to ask questions. So in order to interact with your code, there is another command which is called Code Task. So add comment for this function. And then basically now it has access to that part of the code and uh, gives us a comment and small explanation for this function. And to be fair, I don't know how long I'm going to keep using it, but just for those differences, right at this point, I'm really happy with it. I'll be honest though, it had some issues. It took me a while to realize how to finish the installation and how to make it work. And one of my issues was authentication. Because I'm usually working on remote machines, the uh, source gra graph login command did not work because there was no browser to bring up and allow me to complete the authentication. Luckily, uh, after searching on the GitHub repo, I realized that you can actually pass the keys and uh, your username through environment variables and that would make it work which was quite nice so as far as my configuration is concerned it's actually quite simple um, the source graph plugin just has 
enable Cody to event, insert enter, and auth strategy the environment variables. And here, the nice thing uh, on the completion plugin, I'm basically adding right my LSP and Cody as a source for auto completion. And I think I'll go with that for a few months, see how it goes. And um, like I said, if Copilot up their game. With a new Vim integration, I might give it a go again. Thank you. And that's it for now.